Okay. Sound. 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 Hello! So we're dropping frames. That's a thing. It was a few, but in the past few minutes it's turned into quite a bit. Help me keep an eye on that if you would, please, if it's getting bad. You may want to refresh periodically. I'll check it again in a few minutes. So we got some more diagrams. That's good. I want to do quest and then continue exploring. The rest of the stream today is going to race by. We got started so late. But, um, all right. And something there. There can be only one. I'm exploring. Tomorrow, we'll start to put a question mark on whether or not we're, we're finishing Blood and Wine, because at some point we will. Main quests, some side quests, and a fair bit of exploring left, but it's going to start to come together. Roach quest somewhere down here. Here? Anyways. We may finish Blood and Wine tomorrow, more likely Thursday. Friday's another possibility. Just throwing it out there. Yoey, at least you only have some frames frames dropping. Your new headset just... Mm. Mm. What, um, what about it broke? Other than that, how did you like the play? Hi, by the way. Let's... Go where we're gonna go. There can be only one. On a notice board in Toussaint, Geralt spotted a mysterious notice inviting all who dared to undergo a test of virtue. All who wished to face the challenge, clearly to their character above all, were to find their way to an isle upon Lac Selavi. Our witcher found the notice intriguing enough that he resolved to see what the test entailed. out of the cave first. That'll take any exit. Any exit at all. Smell air? Is there air coming from down here? No, there's just more corpses and air! Over here. We were due for MGS2. Also coming soon is uh, one stream Red Strings Club. That's a one stream game. Uh, so I'm not sure MGS2 is going to be next. And I'm not sure Red Strings is going to be next. I only know. It might be one of those. I used to have more of a plan about these things. I was playing a little Last of Us off stream, but I think we should play it on stream again soon too. That's a few streams, about a three stream game. Um, I know uh, some people want to see this game, some people want to see that game, some people want to see new games, some people want to see old games. I, I'm torn. There's both. All I want to go back and play more Mass Effect. I also think we're probably overdue to play some uh, some games we've never played before. My head's been in a kind of 
Um, I don't want to just fall back on... I don't want to just say, say cyberpunk. Not cyberpunk, but kind of a Blade Runner-y... Dystopian future kind of... Mode. Uh, some stuff I've been watching. Not only am I really curious to see what they're doing with cyberpunk. I want to hear more. Uh, I'm thinking Deus Ex. We never did get to Deus Ex more than a year ago. Getting them confused. Which one did we play? The newer one is Mankind Divided. One we didn't play. I've got it. We just That's when all the next shit happened. That was that we were due to play that in November. It was going to be that and Dishonored 2 and that was all end of 2016. Well, Green, if you can... Yeah, the supernatural stuff in Phantom Pain's a little silly, but the gameplay is pretty awesome, isn't it? If Human Revolution was the one before that, we played Human Revolution. The only one I've played. I have not played the newer one, unless I've got them backwards. Do I have a plan? No, but I want to play all the things. And the backlog is massive. I want to play my favorites. I want to play new stuff. Big stuff, small stuff. Fed a pain again soon too. We I can't just ride through Corvo. Go, go. Roach. Try not to run anyone down. Try to jump the stream. Come on, you got this. You got this, Roach, you got this. Come go! Come on! Yeah! Come on. Defeated by a barrel. Sometimes you've really got to egg Roach on. Bishop at Easter. Which set was that? I saw there were a few of them. One of the vendors that had a bunch of sets. Is there any info so, out on Cyberpunk? No, they just keep teasing. I think they even had, uh, I think CDPR had something today. They said it's more ambitious than Witcher 3. But th th that's just a tease. No, no, there's no information. They're just teasing. Whoa there, Roach. Still excited, still hopeful. Uh, yes. I don't really mind that they're teasing, but the information is scarce. Why we're here, there can be only one. Investigate the Isle of Black Selavi. Walking on 
water. Just like. Like who? Like a pond skater. Who are you thinking? <laughs> no matter. I suppose you thought nothing else in life could surprise you, eh? Wrong. What else is in the water? Since time immemorial have I dwelt in solitude on this shore, and I can testify to the extraordinary nature of the lake. What's so extraordinary about it? I mean, besides the fact that you can walk on its surface. That's not enough. Sword, most wondrous lies in its depths. I watch over it. The blade may be grasped solely by one who possesses the five chivalric virtues. Folk call me a lot of things, but virtuous? I don't know. Yet I do know, for I know who you are. You have proven yourself capable of great sympathy. You are a man of honor, as many can attest. Of humble means yourself. You show generosity to others. Your valor is the stuff of legends. Reason guides your actions, as it does those of all who are wise. You have proven the five chivalric virtues dwell in your heart. You mean the sword's mine? I can dive in and take it? The sword deserves the hand of a master. You must prove your skills are worthy through combat atop the water's surface. Are you ready? Any time. Then draw your blade. <clears throat> Let's dance. No! You have proven <laughs> worthy of wielding the blade. Beyond all doubt. Behold, your Arundite. We've met before. Oh, yeah. Certainly. The hermit admitted he knew you, remember? The Lady of the Lake. It is I. Forget not that you are a man right and honorable, devoted to doing good. And for these reasons, you received the blade. Now bear it. And I trust this time you shall not lose it. And the Lady of the Lake. A little Arthurian legend mixed with your Witcher. You like, yes?
Here, let's check out her character entry. Geralt had first encountered the Lady of the Lake when his search for what had been stolen from Caramor and took him to the village known as Murky Waters. There, a mysterious female being dwelled in the murky depths of the village's namesake waters and watched over the residents living on the shores. Such was their esteem for their underwater guardian, they erected a monument in her honor. The Lady of the Lake once had many knights in her service, but they all... They had all died, as valiant knights tend to during campaigns in far-off lands. She now lived in near solitude. Glad to accept Geralt's company, the Witcher being someone she liked and respected. Once the Witcher had believed the Lady of the Lake was some kind of local goddess, a reunion at Lac Selavi made him realize she did not dwell only in murky waters. Instead, the Lady of the Lake calls home any place where virtue and chivalry are honored. Um, Skuggs, hey. Yeah, I wanted to finish reading that. Not in the games, right? But yes, I, I don't know why I remembered it as two. Green, you're saying first, apparently. But yes, in the game. Woo! <laughs> I forgot about that. Check it out. Yeah. All right. Let's um. Let's read through that special sword instead of slots nice base damage each blow generates charges which increase sword damage by 10 percent charges are lost over time or when receiving damage a fully charged sword always deals critical hit damage killing a foe with a fully loaded sword will expend its charge to permanently permanently increase the weapon's damage now, that doesn't go on forever, but damage is increased by 0 to a maximum of 20, increasing along with your character level. Um, <laughs> use it, it gets better. And in any given fight, the more you use it, the less you get hit while using it, the more the damage builds up. Ah, yes, please. Mm-hmm. I don't think so. Our crossbow that we're using now. It's 200% attack power, 9 to 11. 